Ladies and gentlemen, this is Pasig Garbo sa Subo, prejudging of Festival Queen Costumes. Maayong Adlao Subo! Good morning, everyone! I am Laarni Charity Marie Victoria Martinez from Municipality of Guadalajara. My costume represents various elements of Bolmoano tribe, our history, heritage, and unwavering faith. With these paintings, we're taken from the ceiling paintings of the Nuestra Señora Patrocinio de Maria Parish, Cebu's first national cultural treasure. Bohoon also takes pride of our lost shellcraft, Lagap. These white pearl shells are kept inside frayed shadow boxes, inside a box with a picture of a saint or loved one placed in the center. With this costume, with this costume, I take pride to showcase Bolhaan's heritage. It is it is in Bolhaan where faith and history meet. And with this costume, I take pride to showcase Bolhaan's heritage. And with Bolhaan Festival, we showcase Bolhaan search of faith. Thank you. Mary Josephine Prieto, representing the Bubut Kabog Festival, the municipality of Katmon. So this costume actually um, is inspired from the Bubut Kabog Festival, and this is the most um, famous delicacy in Katmon. So this costume um, emphasizes the Bubut Kabog as a catalyst of creating new memories and milestones of every Katmanadon family. So, I have here the black bodysuit which represents the Kabog. Actually, Kabog um, has a two different meanings which is the millet and the bad. So, this one I have here the millet and the grains, the budbud Kabog and the Katman flower. So, these upper extremities represents the um, with in such film that every that every Katmonanan's life or events are witnessed together with the celebration of the Budbud Kabo. Because as what every Katmonanan say that basta na ay okasyon Budbud Kabo sa Katmon yud ang pangitaon Thank you so much Maayong Bundag Subo. Ako si Crystal Montesilio, gikan sa sugod. This dress is inspired 
by the Greek goddess Gaia. She is a mother of earth and she is a mother of all time. And today's spot is Sigarbu sa Sugu. Sugu will represent God's creation. Thank you. Bianca Berliso Kiliobi representing the Hinolawan Festival of Toledo City. Hinolawan came from a two words, Hinaguang Bulawan, which means Hinaguan is a fruit of labor and Bulawan is a goal. Hinolawan is the biggest and most flamboyant in Toledo City that is celebrated annually every 12th month of June. And coincidentally, celebrated together with the Philippine independence. This costume made with the sheets of gold leaf, the champagne gold for the copper that is abundant in a sea. And the rich gold represents the Tolidonans hospitality and resiliency. This Carved patterns, these different sizes of holographic size stones and special fabrics and to the touch of the designer's artistry on creating this masterpiece sophisticatedly and with class showing the city's abundance of copper. Thank you. of Alcantara 
are so called the wealth or the Bahandi. Bahandi Festival is a celebration of good life, great harvest, and thanksgiving. Bahandi Festival is celebrated in the 28th day of August annually. The celebration honors its patron saint, San Agustin de Hippo. Nature is the most precious gift of God to us. Even if all our basic necessities are fulfilled with nature, whether the air we breathe, the land we live on, the water we drink, and the, and the food we eat, it all comes from the nature. As a lover and a child of nature, we must preserve care, not just in, in our country, but all around the world. Just like a precious treasure, a true Bahani. Thank you. Ako si Jessie D. Thea G. Alberca, by the Anyo Sampano Igon, loud and proud to represent Karkar City, the Kapkatan Festival. We are known for the Heritage City for a reason. This is a costume that is inspired by the history of Karkar. And Kapkaban Festival, from the word Kapkat, a fern in Karkar, it actually resonates the deep-rooted passion for the Karkaranos for music, arts, and culture. These infrastructures that I carry today bear history. And now, let me be your tour guide and I'll give you a quick tour in Karkar City! This is Rotunda, the St. Catherine Alexandra's Parish Church, the St. Catherine's College, Jose Rizal's Monument, let me give you a turn, the Theotoko Shrine, Upland Elementary School, and the Dispensary. All of these buildings were influenced and built during the Spanish and American colonial period. And up until now, it is still standing and it is still present. And that is a testament of the spirit of the Karkaranos of being resilient and being creative. And wait, there's more. Not only that, but we are also known for the shoe capital of Cebu and as well as the mga lamian ng mga delikasya. Apo, muriha! Charun, charun, charun! Bukharin yo, muriha! I stand here not as one, but as the whole of Karkar. This is the efforts and creativity of the whole of Karkaranos. This is Karkar. This is the power of the Kapkaban Festival. <laughs> Ako si George Therese Gabriel Friala, Mapo Seeker Buong Nagara Presentar sa Toslo Festival, Gikan sa Municipalidad sa Uslo. This costume portrays a Madrigra queen, a beauty queen from the 90s. The costume shows the famous and historical landmark in Oslo, the Quarta. I am also holding a scepter that has a ball in the top 
to represent our festival towns, the Toslo Festival. Tell us, Toslo, Ugmat Toslo, Toslo, Nakita.